and you can swap the ordnance express if you just want a normal power armor build with master heavy gunner there's bullet shield expert heavy gunner heavy gunner and bandit leader. you need their per cards exactly like me so in perception there's grenadia so this makes your explosions bigger when you shoot the weapon or when you throw grenades i like this a lot but please if you're gonna use this build don't use it in radiation rumble or event where you're like inside a place then we got refractor then an endurance we have fireproof life giver radical ottoman skeleton and then we have rad resistant and ghoulish this is all what you're gonna need for endurance and charisma looks like this stranger numbers bodyguards travel agent and friend friendly fire so you can heal your teammates in intelligence we have science science expert first aid power user stabilized and lastly batteries included in agility we have through hiker because i like to carry a lot of nico quantums adrenaline and action boy or action girl we have class freak and luck uh, starch jeans good with salt and ricochet but re replace good with salt with one gun army if you're not carrying food like me so let's get into the legendary per cards i've accidentally made a mistake here going out of the thingy so let's go back in so your legendary per cards are going to be what's rads i don't have enough perk points to level this up and then as you can see it's gonna have 300 rad resist restores six rads per second so we have legendary perception luck strength endurance and intelligence so let's get into the mutations i currently have active so the mutations I have active is a general a general reaction, bird bones, eagle eyes, egghead, empath, herbivore, head mentality, marsupial, scaly skin, speed demon, and talons. You can have, be a carnivore to carry more stuff. And this is my set of armor I'm using today, the excavator armor. I will be using this grenade uh, nuka launcher. Plasma Gatling, no, that's not Plasma Gun, the Plasma Gatling and the LMG. As you can see, those this is the weapons I'm gonna be using. You can also get a grenade launcher as a heavy weapon. So let's get into the testing. The mini nuke launcher, as you can see right here, I'm going to be shooting it with Grenadia. As you can see, the explosions are really big and it does a lot of damage. As you can see, there's another shot. Really big explosions. This will also be with Nuka grenades. As you can see, now we're using the plasma gun, doing about 72 damage. We're doing 84 and 167 to the head. I personally like this gun because it feels better using this gun than the other weapons and it does a lot of damage. I'm gonna be using the Holy Fire and show you guys how much damage that does. As you can see we're doing about 87. Fortunately this is also my favorite weapon it does there about 164 and there's 51. I really like this weapon but unfortunately I don't have a lot of ammo for it. Now we're going to use the Gatling laser gun, no, the laser Gatling. As you can see, we're doing a lot of damage with this, about 28 damage, 29, we do about 30. Let's just kill the rest of the super mutants, there we do 64, and there we do about 65, if I can see correctly. Now the last gun I'm going to be showcasing is my LMG. Unfortunately I couldn't bring a grenade launcher because I don't have a grenade launcher. With a new glitch in the game, Grenadia apparently makes a lot of your weapon explosions bigger. As I don't know if this is a bug or Bethesda added this, but usually Grenadia can only make your nuka launcher, sorry I mean 
fat man, the explosions bigger, your grenade launcher and the gran grenades. So I'm going to be showing you guys the mods I use on all of my weapons. So the fat man is just standard as you can see, see there, standard launcher. My plasma gun is prime receiver, standard barrel, standard magazine and reflex sight. The flamer is napalm tank, long barrel, huge propellant tank and then the gatling laser, scatling laser receiver, standard barrel, reflex sight, no muzzle and then my LMG is automatic receiver, long barrel, full stock and drum magazine and muzzle break. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I hope you guys enjoy.